Hello, what's up everybody? How you guys doing? We got Poseidon here versus Kamazots. Uh, this is a matchup I've never seen before, actually. And, um, once again, I really don't like the art cards for the Poseidon abilities now. I, I think they, like, tried really too hard to make them look, like, super artistic. They, they look strange. They, it's not, it's not a good look. I'm not a fan. I don't know about you guys. You might be fans. But, uh, yeah. This is, uh... A weird matchup. Definitely one thing about it is Kamazots can ult out of the Poseidon. Oh. 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 Well. Alright. I had literally no idea. I'm learning new things every day. Apparently that. That kills you. It looked like he had no damage. And then I was shitting on him. But no. <laughs> Clearly not. I mean when you think about it. You don't want to engage a Kamazots or any, or any just burst assassin. Uh, before the wave like that. But I figured I had to drop on him. He was done skis. But no, he was not. Alright, so we're in a rough spot. We're gonna come back. Easily. Still got his jump, so you can just get out of here, sadly. Alright. I think this is... We can come back from this. The annoying thing about this matchup uh, seems like it'll be Poseidon's uh, ult being ulted by the Kamazots. That's the roughest part about it. He didn't even go a Beads or an Aegis because he figures he can just do that reliably, you know? Oh, if that hit, that would be good. He's still got a jump, so I can't even ult him here. Good thing is, we might still be able to get the uh, red. Yeah, it looks like we forced him out enough. The sight is clear is so good. The early poke is so strong. Yeah, so we take this down anyway. And that's a very good look for us. Makes up for that nice little... Not, not that nice little. Makes up for that little uh, spill that we had at the beginning. This guy in chat told me to level the one on Poseidon. My man, that is literally the last thing you level. Well, you can level it before the ult. It's, it's debatable. Wow, see now that's good. <laughs> if he doesn't ult in time. No, nope, you're dead, buddy. He should have killed himself before I uh, I got there. This is best case scenario was to run into the uh, Phoenix. But I probably still would have gotten credit because I had just hit him. I think I hit him with one of my autos on his retreat. Yeah, same as uh, Freya, if the Kamazots doesn't uh, ult early enough during the uh, Poseidon ult, he's gonna get, you know, he's gonna get knocked, uh, or he's just gonna get shit on. <laughs> oh, good juke, very good juke. I'm salty about that juke, actually. If he is through this, I'm gonna cry. Nope, you're dead. Ah. Uh, Wow, god damn it, I fucked up man. I should I was pretty sure that he was gonna try to juke there and for some reason I was just like nope, you know what, I feel confident. Oh my god, that almost killed me. Alright, we're all cool, we're cool here, we're cool. He's fighting back well. It's a good escape from him. After a little bit of an overextension for the wave. I'm definitely no stranger to. He's going straight into Jotun's here though, um, and that might uh, that might hurt him because generally the traditional build for uh, assassins at this time is uh, into either a tier two magical defense or the full bulwark here. I love the tier two defense, and then you go into the Jotun's, but uh, 
if you're behind, like if I'm behind, I'll always go Jotuns just because I really feel I need the damage and they're they're gonna get some defense online and you know blah blah blah. Um, but yeah, in this position, I don't think there's ever reason not to just rush that that early defense uh, if you're at even or ahead. Yeah, he didn't get in time. That's close though. Like that's that's tricky because he used it pretty early. I thought that it might not work. The timing must be really sensitive. There must be a really big window for Kamazots to uh, to still get hit while he's in the air there. Just like Freya though, because hers is there's a pretty wide opening there as well. So that's that's his biggest problem right now is that he didn't go Aegis into Poseidon, and his uh, strategy of just escaping the ult with his ult isn't working. So it's just effectively a god that doesn't have Aegis against Poseidon, and that's really bad. Strange defense here. Kamazots, I think, is. Uh, I don't know. Right now, the only thing about him is he's probably not as good into warriors as uh, as his you know potential against other gods is mages and uh, and assassins and, and such, uh, and some good potential against uh, ADCs too. Whoa, that's pretty crazy. Damn, that's interesting. I didn't know he'd be able to get that at all, but that's good. Um, and warriors are a lot bigger right now. And then there's also things like Hades. Uh, Hades and Anubis. And both of those I feel like should crush him at this point. Just because their items have been buffed so much. And they can sustain through his poke. So easily. So they seem like they would counter him pretty hard to me. Holy shit. He's just like. Just willingly takes so much damage. Oh shit. He's flying away. I was only kidding. I have no idea where he went though. That was some straight up magician bullshit. I figured he had to be on that rock in the corner. Because I had just looked through the wall and seen that he... That's bullshit. That's bullshit. <laughs> I don't want to hear it. That man just... He, he went invisible. You know there used to be a way you can go uh, into the wall over here. You would hide in this wall. It was just a thing you could do in Duel. You could see the name of the person from like an angle, but in general, if you're just looking, you don't see it. Oh shit. My bad. Nice try, Shmageggy. Oh, the creep body blocked it for him, but he's done. Oh, so close. This guy has literally no fear. I've never seen someone so willingly just jump into a Poseidon without his ultimate up. With no plan. He was up against my minion wave, too. He's just... He's fearless. He's dauntless. Did you guys like that movie? I didn't really like that movie. I like that movie. Maybe... No, I didn't really like it. It was like a good, bad movie. My girlfriend read the books, though. She said they were good. What is it called again? Divergent? Yeah. She said the books were, were pretty good. I don't, I don't think, like, great, but, like, good. You know, like, good-ish. Um, alright, let's see. Go Obsidian here. Yeah. Gets. I actually have no idea. I don't know what I want to go here. Hmm. I think I've decided I'm just going to start going Blink. For fun. And it has competitive value, it does, it definitely does. And I'm gonna make that like my thing. I used to just blink all the time and I'm good at blinking. I've done, I do some good blinks, you know? All right, this guy's over there. You guys ready for this? Yeah, the, the film was not very good, yeah. Ah, uh, he's not coming over. What the? He already got it. You're gonna pay, buddy. See, look at this. He doesn't care. Oh, but how did he move so quickly? What do you have? You have wing blade? Or... That's interesting. He does. Oh, I didn't see that. Oh, my bad then. Man. All right. I got completely duped by the wing blade, and then because I was considering what he could have had, fucking missed all my autos like an asshole. Oh shit. Oh my god, if I could have gotten that two out. <laughs> Son of a bitch. 
All right, so it's not clean, but this is a good this is a good rebound game. Every once in a while, you need a game like this, you know, where it's like we have been getting the worst matchups I've ever seen, and just if I do get a good god, it's not a god that I'm very good with, uh, or something extremely unfortunate happens. So I've been in a bit of a slump, and we got demoted from diamond uh, one into diamond two. And, like, that's perfectly fine. That, that happened to us last time, too, because, like, you know, it's an any god to master's uh, account. So sometimes you just get an unlucky string of gods. But um, it has been... It has been brutal. It has just been so many unlucky interactions. Like, I had a Ymir game that was, like, just so heartbreaking because I was playing it. I felt some of the best I'd played Ymir in so long, and yet it just it got me nothing. Okay, it's just wings. You just want to wait for that to run out. Oh, okay, but you got that now too, huh? Oh shit, okay, alright. Oh shit, he's got it. Oh shit, okay. This guy is here to play now. He is saying, my camera has come online, and you and Shadow have underestimated me. Hey, what's up, Zang? So maybe this won't be our rebound game, but this will sink us further into the unknown. I'm not letting it happen. I'm not letting it happen. Your middle tower is under attack. I'm glad you like it, Matt. Yeah, we got a new emote and on a switch. Shadow wave. And I like it a lot. I was skeptical at first, but I like it a lot. This guy's just like rushing all the fucking uh, damage, and it's kind of crazy. It's working out pretty well for him, though. Oh shit, but you fucked up, buddy. You fucked up, didn't you? Oh my god, that hit! What in the fuck? Oh. I was so ready to turn, sunder, and ult, and he was dead because he had no ult. But this, that hit. Alright. Alright. I'm with it. I understand. He is doing so much damage. It's crazy. That, this is an interesting build and it's an interesting approach. Um, the wing blade is just throwing me because for some reason nobody ever like rushes wing blade into Poseidon. So, because I mean, generally people want to get their defense items online first, but I I don't know if it's just me flubbing so much uh, and missing him that's making it worth it. Blink is also not not proven to be good here. Like I said, underestimating him for sure. But I'm saying I'm gonna find a way to make Blink the right choice here for me. I'm gonna try to find a way to make it our choice. How the fuck did he just jump during my cripple, you guys? I legitimately am concerned. Oh, oh shit, this guy is crazy, but I'm so fast you can't even attempt. Yeah, see you later, bro. Alright, you guys wanna see a hype blank thing. Okay, I was so good there, though. Oh shit, you're almost dead, bro. Yeah, I was waiting for that one. Thank God we got him! Alright, so that blink would have been so cool. See, I'm gonna I'm a, I'm a find the title surge after that one next time. Yeah, I know it doesn't apply to the first tick, the cripple, but he was in it for seven ticks was the problem with it. That interaction for me personally. It felt as though he was in there for much larger than one tick. You gotta go fast. You gotta go faster, 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 faster. Bancross might work on Poseidon. It seems to work on literally everyone. It's just a broken ass item. But in Duel, the, Poseid the Poseidon build in general, I feel like is so carefully crafted that I don't, I don't know, you know? I don't know, you know? This guy is crazy with his fire giants. I keep forgetting that it's even an option back quickly, you know? Like I said, I'm doing some major uh, underestimation this uh, this game in general, so... That's a big error on my part. Try to seal this out. 
So when you think about it though, that blink did lead us to the W there. Oh wow, that's my bad. Oh, we hit him with the thunder. Oh well, fucka me. Oh, that was so close. The one was on him and it hit him, and I saw it. And the alternate universe that hit. I'm cheering right now. We're all screaming. I won the game. We're all hyped. Everything is great. <laughs> Why did I go for it? Probably because, like I said, I've been in a super big rut lately, so I want to like do some fun, impressive shit to get myself hyped and get you guys hyped. Because, like I said, I've just not been performing too well. Uh, or not just like performing well, but I haven't have given that the chance in a lot of positions. And it's just... It's been gross, you know? So I do everything in my power to do some cool shit. Just cover the option there with that. And there you go. Just like that. Easy does it. I also feel confident against this guy. Like I said, I'm being, being a little silly because he, uh, I, I feel confident here. But I feel confident on my Poseidon against anyone that's not, like a, you know, a top ADC or whatever. Uh, even though this matchup could could be winning for him. You know, any, anything that's not uh, S plus and above. so fast I love him yeah I think if I play more Poseidon I'll be more happy just more of the gods that I enjoy um, but also Thor they took my Hunbots away from me this season and then they just nerfed him now again too it's like when does it end meta changed a lot in duel which made Hunbots less viable in my opinion uh, with the rise of the warriors and now the sustained gods um, and then there's just fucking the big ass nerf to his ultimate uh, and to well the 10 second uh, cooldown difference on his ultimate and the change to uh, to the one his jump no longer has a good slow on it now it has a really shitty slow for a very long time until super late game just trying to cut off his options here make him miss the wave and he did miss the wave so that's good Always gotta remember when playing against Kamazots, which he has up, the one or the two, because the one will go through the wave, obviously, whereas the two won't. Uh, and, you know, it seems simple, but it's easy to forget that. They're very similar items. Uh, items, goddammit. Very similar abilities. He's got an Aegis fan, yeah. I pressed the wrong button. I pressed the T screen! Somebody in a recent video told me, and Shadow, please find your T screen to something else and you are right my friend you are the reason that we will never do that again uh let's bind it to period period seems good i'm down with that he ain't gonna get shit his, look at his minion wave isn't even there easiest not phoenix loss of my life bro all right. Like I said, rebound game. Rebound game, you play silly. All right? You just feel me, you know? You have fun with it and win. If you don't win, though, the after, like, if we, I, if I don't win this game, there will be crippling despair. And it sucks because I'm undervaluing this guy. He should be in a position where it's, you know, definitely uh, doable for him to win this. So I don't think I'm saying this guy's bad by any means. Because he's not, he is playing as well, too. Okay, interesting. He finally got defense and he actually had Mantle of Discord? I've never even seen that. I've literally never seen that in Duel. That is so interesting. GW, thank you so much for the one year, man. Oh, and Scythe, thank you so, so much. For the sub, dude. For the resub. I really appreciate it. Um, what do we have here now? Uh, 
uh, we have a broken notification system on Twitch, as usual. So, it didn't show up, I will make sure it shows up after this game, man. Thanks so much. Yeah, it's been happening. New subs don't show up, old subs do. If you refresh the page, I think it'll let you uh, show it. Oh, he missed. That's really crucial. See, this is the hard part. Uh, when Poseidon gets this uh, Fatalis along with the Gem of Ice, so that's when things get real fucking rough. Oh, so close. The, it procced his uh, whatever that fucking thing is. Cloak of Despair or something. Um, and now we are able to take this down. Yeah, so at this kind of at this point in the game, I feel like Poseidon would win this, you know. In the early to mid, uh, Kamazat should definitely be able to show some dominance. The later it goes, the more ISO Talus you're running into, and it gets very frustrating. G1, thank you so much for the two months. Where do you go, you guys? Yahoo! Yeah, see, if you can navigate around him like that, then... Oh, shit. But he is still Sundered, so he's going to be taking an enormous amount of damage as long as we hit it. There we go. Got him. Scythe, thank you so much, man. G1, thank you again. I thank you guys all so much for watching. We ended it at even 6-6, and we did get our victory, so... Let's get some good games going on from now on, and uh, I'm going to try to uh, pick myself up out of it and, and do this. So that's this Kamazat, so he played it well, and he played it interestingly with a really peculiar-ass build. Wow, we only got six for that. Oh shit, Demotion? Only... Demotion brings you to 70 TP? Oh my god, we're going to... Oh, this is the easiest day of my life. I thought Demotion meant zero TP again. I'm so pumped. We got 70? Oh, shit.